Pearl River has been warmly welcoming the world this summer and drawing in adrenaline junkies for the BC bike race. The challenging single track course is a credit to Pearl River's bike club. Our bike club wasn't sure whether the town was ready for it and uh, they're more than ready for it. Everyone is just thrilled and uh, I'm overwhelmed by the support. And when we had a little incident where we lost a bridge that we absolutely needed for the race, it was amazing the different groups that, it, 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 it was the silver lining because it, it was the first time I can remember that so many different outdoor recreation user groups got together to help out and make something happen. We, it was like a barn raising, an old fashioned barn raising. We, we made a new bridge in, in no time. Traveling with the racers up Vancouver Island and down the Sunshine Coast is an entourage of supporters. For us this year, it's uh, really exciting to have 33 countries represented. So people nice from wheels, all over the world, uh, when, when you build something, people will come. So this is an example of, there's an amazing mountain bike community here in Powell River that perhaps uh, some locals may not be aware of how strong the mountain bike community is here in Powell River. The trails that they've built here are amazing. The last couple of years it's been really well received as one of the favorite stages. Nice job. On the finish line, rider 170, so team number four. This is my first time at the BC Bike Race. I've always wanted to come out to, up to BC. I live in uh, Boulder, Colorado. Um, it's really great to come and see the trails here. They're really different from anything I've ever ridden. Really technical, really wet, really green and vibrant and beautiful. It's really amazing here. It's, it's like magic. To get your piece of the magic, contact any outdoor recreation group. For The Daily, in Powell River, I'm Michelle Hignall.